Hello everyone, welcome back to Johnny's NASAC channel. Today I would like to introduce an interesting online web service. It's coming from Uptime Robot. I do have some project I worked on to build my own monitoring website, like this one. It's coming from Node Query and they have APIs so we can build our own node monitoring page like this one. So it will show your VPS, road, memory, disk. Uh, there's some limitations on Node Query which is only 10 VPS can be monitored and it's only used for Linux server monitoring. So I always wondering to build uh, my website monitoring tool using uh, some APIs, uptime robot providing like 50 monitoring and it's five minutes check and they total free and also they have APIs. They also providing a web page to show you your monitoring status, which you can link to your own domain. If you are interested to build your own uptime status page, you can use this GitHub project to look at it and then build your own. For me, I would like to show you how to use uptime robot to do that without using any program language without using your own space on server to do that. So let's start it. First you need to have your own account with Uptime Robot. Go to dashboard. I already created three offerings to monitor in my website. You can add more. Total is 50 and also you can monitor in uh, TCP port, pin and also keyword. Uh, I'm going to add one here, just monitoring one of my uh, website. It support IP, but if you have domain name, that's also fine. The, main, the free version at least is five minutes, but that usually should be enough. You don't have to configure advanced settings until it is necessary to do that. And uh, you can select uh, a lot for your contact. Close. So probably in 30 seconds to one minute, this is gonna show you your status. So we just created the next cloud top 51 sector org monitoring. Then what do we need to do? We don't need to know any program language, we even don't need to know any APIs. We can directly go to status page, creating your first status page. You can customize your logo and then you also can custom your domain. So for me, I would just do that. I'm going to use my own domain to do that. But we need to create the same name DNS record, the point to status. And right now, I didn't create that. So its site is not reachable. What we need to do is go to DNS tab, add a record. Of course, it's a CNN record. And target will be the status dot uptime robot dot com. You can close this. Save. While it's saving, we can add our status page, create page. We can move, add all monitors here, those four monitors. One probably down right now, but the other three should be fine. Let's save it. 
Now refresh your page. Right away it shows up. So this is going to be your own free serverless website monitoring center. You don't need to know any program language. You don't need to know API. You don't even need to know where it hosted. It's in the cloud somewhere. Of course, it's in the uptime robot server. This small logo shows powered by uptime robot. If you are fine with that, then it's perfect for you. If you don't like it, you want to do it on your own. This gives you an option. This GitHub uptime dash status project will give you an option to customize it, fully control which going to show and how you want to show it. That's today's content I would like to share with you. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Thank you.